It's Jeremy and with HJH Adventures. We've been out on family activities all day. Your family, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And so we finally got home. It's late at night here in Ohio. It's freezing, but we couldn't wait. So we got the trailer, pulled it over here into the garage, and we're going to start the unboxing because we've got this gut instinct that there's got to be something good because, let's face it, you're good luck, right? Try to be. Yeah, try to be. <laughs> uh huh. So let's find out. You excited? I am. Me too. These are the totes that we pulled out of the trailer. There's still more stuff in the trailer, but this is what we're gonna try and sort through this evening. What got us really excited is this rifle lamp. Really cool. But the other thing that got us excited, George, what you got? This handy dandy sword. You never know when you need it to slice watermelon or anything else, right babe? Right, right, right. right. All right, let's dig in and let's see what we can find. Tote number one, the official unboxing, Georgia's first storage unit. We got Care Bears, and if they're old school Care Bears, they're actually worth something. We're gonna look for a date, and 2003, not very old. We've got, we got some personal items here. I'm gonna set those aside, we'll go through those later. We may need this garbage bag, so there you go, George. George is, George is right behind me doing the filming and the, ed the editing. Look at this, Elvis. Elvis right there. Any of you Elvis collectors, you know Elvis put a tremendous amount of stuff out there. Autographs, pictures, photos. So not too much is rare, but boy, if, if anybody else isn't collectible like him, I don't know who is. We've got... we got something here. How's that? Oh, there we go. Okay. Inside here, we have records. Dave Parsons. We've got... What's this, baby? Coin. Okay. All right. These look like... Can you open those and see what those are? Mm -hmm. Just wait. There. I, I don't think they're much of anything, but... Oh! Here's Elvis's Jailhouse, Jailhouse Rock single. It looks like tokens. Oh, those are Chuck E. Cheese. Go ahead and put them over here in the camera. <laughs> yeah. Hey, you want to go on a date to Chuck E. Cheese? Sure. Sweet! All right. Uh, I don't know what this is, but probably... Whoa, 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 baby, 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 baby. Oh, okay. All right, this looks like all foreign coins. GR Coins, if you're watching, this one may be your pouch. Look at the... Oh, baby, I just dropped that. Look, there's paper money in there. I just dropped one down in here. Uh, here's a peso... 1975, oh my goodness, what is all of this? Republic, Columbia, half, here's a half penny, 1911. You coin collectors, you know this stuff better than I do. Start telling me, what did we get here? This is Georgia's good luck unit. Look at this, already with the coins. First, my goodness, first tote. Okay, this is a 1977 Republic of Columbia. This says $100, 1964. Don't know what kind of coin it is. Uh, 1965. Guys, there's coins. There's everything here. Canadian. I'm not seeing any, any English coins. But you can take a peek here. All right, where's, where's the paper where's money? The paper what do we money? got? What do we got? Bank of England. Really? And money from There's Brazil. another one. There's another one in here. So Brazil and England? Mm -hmm. Okay, can you put that back in the little purse? I can't believe this. This is your first unit and the first tote. Okay, I just found another money pouch. Okay, these all are gold in color. Franklin Roosevelt, 1945 coin. United States of America, bicentennial coin. Dwight Eisenhower coin, 1981. John F. Kennedy, I actually have one of these. I have one of these for sale on eBay right now. I have one of these already. I've never seen the others. All right, we got Abraham Lincoln, Thomas Jefferson, we got George Washington and Truman. All right, those were all in that pouch. This is awesome. <laughs> you are such good luck. My goodness. And this is your first tote? How do you do it? 
Okay, we gotta see what else is in here then. All right, that's it looks a, like a pencil sharpener. Yeah, that's good job. Just, just be patient with me because some of this stuff is personal. Uh, here's a Ponderosa Golden Advantage Club. So we've got somebody of age. And there we have the person here. Hold that aside. This looks like definitely keepsakes. Here's a do-it-yourself guitar pamphlet. Cool. This is cool. All right, so coins in here, a great thing. The paperwork we're gonna have to go through in more detail in a bit. A little something for, for injuries. Sewing machine, there is a sewing machine. We left that in the trailer because sewing machines aren't all that exciting for you guys. Babe, here's that coin I dropped. There it is. Okay. Look at this, Basic Field Manual, Soldier's Handbook, 1941, World War II collectible, right here. Coins and World War II collectibles. I love it! Baby, how in the world did you know? You <laughs> I told just had me. a good feeling. Candles, all right, we're gonna, we'll, we'll turn those into fire starters. This looks like an old book for sure, let's see. What do we have here? All right, new practical arithmetic. And any of you guys who know your arithmetic, you probably remember your Roman numerals. I don't. John Wayne, there was a John Wayne clock. Mm -hmm. This person definitely has some collectibles. I don't know if that's a famous person or if that's personal. Baby, there's no way we're gonna get through all this tonight if it's all like this. Check that out. So is this That's a neat. do you That's call a that candle holder? Candle abra or it's like a... look at that. Okay, I think this is an angel waterfall. So that's probably a waterfall for with angels in it. Um, whoa, 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 whoa! All right, definitely antique lamp here. Okay, this piece. I don't think the candle belongs there. Okay. So this is an antique lamp. Maybe this piece is broken off. But I think... I'm not sure how that actually goes, but it's a really cool piece. Oh, you know what? The Babe, look, 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 look. See these Asians down here? Mm -hmm. I think they go... Yep. Look, there's another Asian down there. So this was broken ahead of time. Here you go. Asian art. It's pretty neat. That's amazing. Okay, we're gonna set that in here. Oh, you know what? Here's the top to it. Oh. So that screws on the top. Okay, there's an old dowel. And yeah, this might have been ornaments. Antique ornaments, maybe. But Time didn't do them too well. It says Terry's Indians. All right. So that paperwork you just found, mm -hmm. the owner of this unit, you can go ahead and take the lid off. The owner of this unit, uh, when were they born? Found out she was born in 1918, which so, means... 100 years old. 100 years old. So most likely has passed away, unfortunately, and most likely with no heirs that we can tell so far. So this looks like... This says Terry's Indians. All right. Just from the initial glance, what do you think on the initial glance? Of what it could be? Yeah. No idea. My guess is they collected Indians. There's a buffalo. Is there any markings on the bottom? Everybody's got a water buffalo. A water buffalo. Yours is fast, but mine is slow. Everybody's got a water buffalo. <laughs> Here's the first Indian. Wow, we have Indian collectibles too. Look, 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 look. See this? This slides into something. This is part of a oh, bigger. That's probably part of this is probably. Yep. 
Wouldn't it go right in that notch? Does it fit? I guess not. Okay. Wow. Another Indian head. Which probably goes... Wow. Sweetheart, you're so much more gentle with this stuff than I am. <laughs> it takes a woman's touch. That's cool. Look, look how full that tote is, too, of all Indian collectibles. Okay, so we got coins. We got Elvis. We got World War II. And we're getting Indian collectibles. Case collection. Can you put it right up here? Mm-hmm. Okay. On that one, I saw a grease marking, which means it probably came from Goodwill. Grease marker. Look at that one. This one's neat. How cool. Another water buffalo. Wow. It looks like real hair, too. Look at that. <laughs> this one kind of looks like me. That one does look like you. Only you're quite a bit prettier. <laughs> I wonder... That's a donkey, right? Is it a horse? Mm -hmm. oh, I was going to say, I wonder if that's a manger scene from for Christmas. So we got a horse. This guy's heavy. My tired little Eskimo. Masterworks. Let's see. Let's put that right up in there. And then... Oh, this is pewter. Nice. Solid. Wow. Oh. That looks like you too. That is. is that Pocahontas? Pocahontas. Disney toy. So we got a Disney toy in with the real collectibles. Is that Pocahontas' dad? Hmm. Could be her uncle. He lost his nose. Uh oh. That's a big one. Wow. This one's really dusty. We like dust. Is that a dream catcher? Mm-hmm. Are you through half of it yet? No, there's still a ton in there. <laughs> there's no way we're going to get through the, all these totes like we were planning tonight. Oh, look at... Is that like a Precious Moments? Is there anything on the bottom? Uh-uh. All right. There was something. Maybe it's just a generic. Part of something, huh? Looks like just a pile of rocks. Oh! That's just me shaking it all up. Okay. Little Indian girl. Yeah, goodwill marking, most likely. Thrift store. What's she holding? Another one of Kay's collections. Hmm. And another one. Look, Hello. it's your twin. Hello from Hawaii. There's just... We saw another one like this, right? Yeah. 
That one has a Goodwill marking on it as well. Yep. That's the baby horse or the mama horse. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Another horse. Nice. This one's heavy. Any markings? No. I don't think it's a boy horse. Just a <laughs> sneaky suspicion that this one got castrated. Mm -hmm. That stallion, not a stallion anymore. <laughs> That's another thrift store. Yep, thrift store. That one looks like a big one. could be an older version of me. What's the front say? Rich. The collection. rich collection. Hmm. Okay. Is that like a plaster mold? Oh no, that's ceramic. Ritzman Pharmacy, that's a local pharmacy that they bought it from. This is a pretty piece. What do you, how do you display it? It's got a cone at the bottom. I think there's another one in here. So, so does it sit in something? Hmm. China. Another little buffalo. Mm -hmm. Nice. This is a cool one. Yeah, it is. This tote is taking forever. <laughs> My goodness. We should Indian theme a bedroom. <laughs> What's the bottom look like? That one looks like thrift store as well. Probably Volunteers of America. They use the odd numbers like that. Another horse. Male or female, babe? We're gonna go <laughs> undisclosed on that one. Is this a briar? Yep, sure is. That's a briar. Another little Indian girl. more you got in there uh, I think I have three more pieces three more that tote was full what do you got a little Indian girl it looks like Goodwill find again or thrift store find all right last piece this one's huge Looks like some of the other pieces go to that. Mm -hmm. Wow. 
We're going to have to figure out how to put this stuff all together. How about we grab another tote? As well. Tote number three, here we go! Looks like we got a music box with... Here's some jewelry inside. And that does not... See if you can find... I don't think you're going to find any markings on that, babe. This is casting jewelry. It's this. Oh, uh, what do you call it? That's not Red Cross. What do you call that? Oh, well, the individual had epilepsy. So I'm going to send that over to you. Let's see if there's anything else in here in regards to jewelry. We've been hitting it big already. Look at this little music box. You know what song that is? That song is You Light Up My Life. That song was perfect for you and me, George. Because <laughs> you light up my life. Here we go, baby. Okay, we got an I Love You Bear. I'm going to hold that and give that to George for Valentine's. Hopefully she forgets. We got this really awkward porcelain cat sitting on a half crescent moon. We got a lot more collectibles. Okay, definitely thrift store junkie, 191, which I can uh, uh, definitely appreciate. I think this is supposed to be a teapot. And then you put it in there, but there's no spout to pour out. So definitely a thrift store find there. And, oh, baby, look. That, uh, look at the blue on the, the duck on this. Okay, if you guys remember and you saw the $180 unit with all the African art, I found this same exact glass piece in that unit, but it didn't have these blue tints to it. Check that out. It's really cool. It's dusty. Very dusty. All right, we've got some more musical items. All right, we're going to set that one aside and let it go, let it roll. Little trinkets. Little little clown, another little trinket decoration. Here's some beautiful hummingbirds. We got the heritage house there on the hummingbirds. Okay, we gotta be careful here. This this already broke, so we're gonna just set that one aside, babe. This might be an Emmett Kelly clown. Whatever kind of clown it was, she got it for a dollar. Thrift store junkie. Can't beat the deals. All right, that's a light for one of those prisms, which we'll probably find the prism in here. Oh, here's a snow globe. I know you guys love these snow globes. This is Friends Are the Best Collectibles. Let's see what it plays. I don't know that song, do you, baby? I don't recognize it either. All right, we'll set that one aside because there's more. We got a Mickey Mouse collectible here. Animal Kingdom clock in the middle. See if we have the dig in the boneyard. We don't have a date on it. Pretty cool piece there. Pretty heavy, too. Uh, we've got a decorative glass. I'm going to set that aside over with George. Here is another snow globe. For all you zebra lovers. You guys who love zebras, there you go. I don't know the song, but I would do if I could walk and talk with the animals if I was making one. All right. Here's a white tiger. And... Strawberries for goodness. Not sure that's a mini snow globe. Oh, 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 what's this down here? Okay, I'm gonna get to it. That looks like it could be a chest. Asian piece of art there. Just hand that over to George. This, well, this I thought was potentially a jewelry box. It's the Eiffel Tower. 
I'll hand that off. Okay, baby, there's, there's a couple more pieces in here. Okay, another music box with dolphins and a lighthouse. I'm gonna hand that off to you too, babe. You're the DJ McMixer right now. All right, the rest of these are porcelain pieces found at the local thrift store. Tote number four. What's the what's the outside of it say? Macmillan. Macmillan. Uh, on the on the base of it, it says literature-based reading activities. Mm -hmm. What you got? Looks like all personal items. Yeah. Um, I'm not gonna go through this. Let's um try and find the family and return it. Yep. We'll just set that aside. All right, hope chest. Here we go. This is really one of the reasons why we bought the actual item. We got purses. Okay. And we always look for money, but there is, there's just a ton of personal information in this right now. So, well, we got phone numbers too, so we can contact the family numbers. The phone numbers are right there. Set that aside. Let's see what we got here. This sounds... What is this? Yeah! Yes! 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 I knew it! I knew it! I knew it once you saw that lamp. I knew it! What I've never that? heard of Rossi before. I've never heard of Rossi before. It's a gun, baby. Look at it. What kind of gun? Uh, R-O-S-S-I. I've never heard of Rossi before. Rossi, have you guys ever heard of Rossi? This says match pairs two guns in one. A Rossi. Okay, it gives a website, www.rossiusa.com. Yes! Look at this. We're gonna have to put it together. There's a shell. There's a shell in here. Okay, we got the stock barrel. It's all here. There it is here. I'm gonna bring the camera up on it. There it is. Now we paid $150 for the unit. This one gun potentially could pay for the entire unit right there. Nice. Oh, I love it. I love it. Good find, baby. Yeah. Okay, let's see. Okay. Um, this is just a zip up case. We'll just set it right aside over there. Okay. Yes, 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 yes. We'll... Okay. We got Betty Boop, and something's heavy in the bottom. Maybe we got a pistol. No, we don't. We've got, I can't get it out, whatever it is. Okay, what's what's the record? Alabama. Okay, Alabama. Okay. I got these weird things down in this Betty Boop purse. Uh, these look like displays for something. Cutting boards, maybe? No, I don't know if they're cutting boards. I would think they were going to display something. All right, we got a duster. Get them cobwebs out. All of you people seeing orbs flying in front of the camera right now, those are not ghosts from the dead. That is <laughs> dust from a dusty garage where we're at. Uh, here it looks like... Whoops, I get too excited. I start hitting stuff. Here's how to, a light switch works. So somebody made a little project here. We'll set that aside. We got another purse. Remember, didn't I find money in the uh, $180 one in the purses? I think so. All right, nothing's in there. You can double check. Oh, my heart's still beating, babe. I love it. <laughs> I love it. We got coins in the first one, Elvis. And now the gun. Okay, there's a purse there. Nothing in it. This one's got something in it. And this one has Expo Eraser. We need this in the bathroom where we're right on the, right on the yeah, we mirror. We'll take that up. This feels heavy. Wouldn't that be cool if we found more coins? Mm -hmm. All right, there's something in here. Pineapple purse. It is some kind of compass. So some type of compass that you would clip onto you? I'm not sure. I've never seen one like this before. I've done a lot of orienteering. All right, we'll set that aside. And here's a gap purse. 
I don't feel anything in there either. All right, we got a box. This, I don't, babe, you speak so many languages. Do you know what this is? Fazi Batagalia. You know what that is? Mm -mm. All right. It's Italian. You think that's Italian? Yeah. All right, she says it's Italian. Say it with your best Italian accent. Oh, she's actually right. Imported from Italy. So there you go. Gift selection imported from Italy. Baby, I don't have an accent for anything. <laughs> okay, we got... Here's Elvis. Can you open that in front of the camera? Show them what's in it. It's a candy. It's a chocolate box. An Elvis chocolate box? Yeah. There's nothing special in here. Okay, I got I got some sticks probably to a kite. Uh, here's the life insurance policy. Let's set that aside. Okay. Uh, look at what we got. Look at this, guys. Look at this. Special officer. I don't know what for. This might come in handy for you because you're a speed demon. Let's hope so. Uh, the card says, I'm going to cover the card. The card says, Division of Police, Member of Junior Police Post. So there you go. Special Officer Badge right there. So somebody was into the police thing. We got paperwork. Let's set that aside. All right, here we go. This says a lump of coal on the outside. And... I don't know. Babe, we got more coins. Nice. Okay. I can't get into this with my gloves. Can you take those? All right. Let's see what we got here. Let me get my gloves off. Let's see what's in here first. There are coins down on the bottom. Let's see what's wrapped up. All right, here's the, here's the lump of coal. We found the coal. Can you save this? This is going in my stocking. <laughs> okay, let's see what we have here. We've got a Washington, the 42nd state coin. We've got a, I don't even know what that is coin. We've got me dropping stuff coin. We've got a no cash value. Probably another no cash value, no cash value, and a key. Oh, hold on to that. Yeah, here's here's those as well. Is this a lighter? Yeah. Okay, we got a we got an old brass lighter. Okay. Let's see what else we got. We got another purse. This thing is chucked full with purses. Uh, was a smoker apparently. Actually, not a smoker. This, well, maybe a smoker. Okay, it's, it's a seahorse. Look at that, guys. Where do you hide your seahorse? <laughs> I hide it in my marble pack. This can go up in the bedroom. That's so cool. Okay, let's see if there's anything else. This unit for 150 bucks so far, I love it. How do you beat it? Any unit you get a gun in. Okay, we got a cowbell. More cowbell. Actually, two cowbells. I'm going to pass this off to you. There's a couple more few things in there. We're going to get down into here. Yeah! Babe, look! No what? freaking way! What? No way! Is that no. real? Yes, it's real. Feel it. No way. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Ring everything Babe. To find the gun. Ring Babe. Down. Babe. You've got to be kidding me. No way. Babe, look at this. No way. Oh my goodness. High point firearms, model 995. Let me show it to him. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm sorry. This is crazy. Oh my goodness, look at this. Oh uh, yeah. Sweet. When are we going shooting? Uh, when do you want to go shooting? We're gonna have to check the serial numbers first, sweetie. Oh man, alive! Okay, be careful with that. <laughs> yes! Yes! 
Yes, yes. Okay, there's got to be. All right, let's go through the rest of this fast because who, who knows what else? Okay. Oh my, my goodness, my heart is pumping. Uh, we got an old video camera. We're going to set that aside. Let's keep going. Is this what I think it is? This is what I think. We got a safe. Wait, that key. I found a key. Baby, 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 baby. You got a key? Is this Let's it? Let's try the key. That's not it. That's not it. Mm. We got a safe. Oh, okay. All right. We're going to wait. We're going to try and wait until we find a key and try not to do this with a sledgehammer this time. <laughs> Set that aside, baby. Shake it again. See if it sounds like metal. Just shake, shake it. I don't know. It could be ammunition. It could be a handgun. No, wait, 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 wait. Hold a second. Here, we got a clip. We got a clip. We got a clip. We got a clip. Oh my goodness. Okay, get rid of this stuff. This is junk. There's gotta be something else in here. That clip may go to the, to the other gun. All right, let's just set these purses aside. Let's get the blanket out. Another purse. Let me check the purses. I'm gonna check them really quick to see if there is any guns in them. Uh, I'm not sure what that is. Nothing in there. Oh my goodness. Is your heart racing? Oh. Okay, we got a fanny pack. We got a fanny pack and nothing. We got moccasins. We better check everything. The moccasins haven't been made yet. Okay. Right here, right here, right here, right here. We got a Glock. We got a case. Yeah! <laughs> yes! Yes! Woo, yes! Baby. Oh my Lucky goodness. Man. Oh my goodness. You got to be kidding me. Nice. Nice. Yes. Oh, it was right down there in the corner, the Glock case. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. You have you ever heard me this excited before? <laughs> Never. Oh, man alive. Did you see that? This woman didn't mess around. Holy cow. Well, apparently she was a cop, too. Wow. All right. Breathe, baby. Breathe. Breathe. Inhale. Oh, my goodness. All right. This says Christmas. They, let's just... All right, there's nothing, there's nothing else in here. So here's, here's what I'm going to do. Uh, we, we just found, how many, how many guns did we find? Three. three. Okay, we got three guns. So we got enough to go through, and we found the safe. So uh, what we're going to do, let's just clean up. Let's clean up what we got. Let's get the guns taken care of. What we'll do, we'll do another unboxing video tomorrow. We'll hope to get into the safe Without breaking it, we'll try and find the key. And if your heart isn't pumping, mine is for you. This has been Jeremy and George with HJH Adventures. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Tomorrow, we got all the rest of this stuff to go through. And George, what, I can't even think right now. What is it that you usually tell them to do? Adventure awaits. Go find it.